Hello, today we are looking at 12 items that you could possibly give as gifts during this season to filmmakers or people in the film industry. Okay, ready? For those of you who just meeting me for the first time, my name is Alec Godwin and um, we do, here we do music movies, tech reviews, short films, feature films, documentary, the whole nine. Basically, if you love to watch movies or learn how to make movies, then this is the channel for you. Today, I think I got some unusual gifts that uh, will usually strike a chord, you know, when you give it out. I have used every item, every item I'm going to talk about today. I have used. If, I am if you got any of these items, it's a plus. There's no, there's no controversy. If you're giving us a gift, regardless of the prices, because most of them are affordable, but you, you, they are just uh, well thought gifts, in my opinion. Okay, so here are the twelve. So number one, measuring tape. Now hold on, this is not just an ordinary tape. This is unique. It makes life easier. Now, look at this. Look at this. It has a screen here. Because on set, before your talent come on, on stage, you want to make all this uh, measurement and stuff like that. This guy will, will both show you the measurement. You can look at it on this strip. But to make life easy, it is showing the else. The, you see the data, the metric? It is, okay. It is showing the measurements here. You already can see. You, um, you can set it up to if you're measuring in um, feet, inches, or um, meters. You could, you know, set it up here, and then it will show you the result in meters as you pull it out. So I don't just any measurement I pull out. Instead of me to look at this and say it's a uh, 3.66. It's already showing, and this is never wrong. You, you could guess it wrong, but this one will get you the right exact point where it's at. Good. Number two, it's a light tube. Now, I've, I've shown this on my channel, and I use it every time. It's, it's right there right now. It's working right now, okay? I'm not going to grab it, but I'm going to show you a clip. So, can he, um, if that's how they pronounce it, so can he. They have, um, they produce lights. I've used uh, one of their lights before, and this is uh, one of my best products from them, and one of my best um, tube lights uh, because it has a fit and it changes colors, easy to use, it's durable. I've crashed that thing a couple of times. I've, I, I actually thought that it was going to break, it still came on. Number three is a um, loudspeaker. Most directors use for for uh, for set. I don't know if there's a specific one they use, but I did find this one on Amazon, and uh, I thought it was pretty good, pretty portable, right? You got power battery in here. You put the battery in here, and the battery lasts. Push. You see that the battery is in there. So um, five, four, three, two, roll tape, action. You know, try not to be too loud because they're still, my kids are still, my family is still sleeping. But it is loud enough, at least for my set. I, uh, when I'm shooting my stuff, I, I don't have a large crew. This will definitely do more than enough to get to everybody without losing your voice and screaming on set. Great item to give to any director, from music videos to movies to short films. This is great. Okay. Number four. I'm going to go to three types of power. Number four, five, and six will be power based, but they are a little bit different now. Let's start from the um, PD power. These guys, I've talked about them on the channel. There are a couple of them. These guys are not just power banks. No, these are PD powers. They are very powerful, usually powers from USB-C. And I showed one recently that has two USB C's so I can power my Blackmagic 6K or 4K or you know 6K Pro alongside the monitor. I have a whole video for that and I will link it up there and in the description so you guys can check it out and see how that works. I have about I have about six 
of these power banks in case I want to go run and gun style and power from this guy three three hour 30 minutes some of them can take up to four hours and four hours 30 minutes depending on the battery uh, power and size so the, those ones are a little bit bigger this is this is a great uh, gift to give out agree next it's a, like I said the next one is power again and this time we are looking at uh, VMAT batteries you, we all use it but when you give somebody a small one a really portable one like this one from Andy Cine see how small it is see how portable it is it has one USB port and two D taps you want to keep your rig light and this is a solution 4K 6K 6K Pro this guy will do you well for a couple of hours I got another one that's this small but it's it got more juice but it's still portable you see that i know this is a lot smaller but this has more power so this is also a good gift when you give someone this size of vmat batteries they know you you want them to live long <laughs> you know oh, and the third version of power oh my god this is my new best friend it's like this is how i power on location these days these are power stations like well i do i have the aperture 120d but uh, trying to get my set i i went with the amaran uh, lights um the amaran light setup which are a lot cheaper this is how i power them now i get this one to an extension just like your direct power at home this is um, um, the most powerful one i have three of them now this is another one very small and powerful not as powerful as this one but close this is perfect to just move around and then the third one here we are for some reason when i was um trying to make this video today i um i went to the bathroom and tried to shave and it didn't um this the the socket wouldn't work i think it got blown out i don't know what happened so just to meet up the time i had to switch up and put it on this guy all they all have the 110 volt options on the power switch on here and then if you want to use this one you turn on it's the same thing for all of them you turn on the power here see there's a light here it's on this is how i shaved just before i started this video even non-filmmakers should have this ladies and gentlemen this headphone is the bomb it is outstanding good quality now you look at it you say it's bluetooth but you could power it uh, the wire is by my system out there I, I use it for editing because of course you don't use bluetooth for ed editing you'll be having audio issues but when i connect it with the wire and connect it to my computer i'm on sync everything works well so it's both a bluetooth and it's wired as well but that's not just the only thing that makes it unique it is lightweight and it sounds so good for so cheap but this is this is surprisingly very good very very good very very good when i said i was shaving right now i said i was shaving this thing was on my ears downstairs in the bathroom and everything i was playing up here i could hear as in without breaking it it transmits through walls i wish my phone was like that i'm walking in the garage downstairs far away between two three doors to the garage this thing is solid clear like it is like like the system is on my in my pocket i love watching um uh, directors uh, round table when i'm doing work at home these guys are on my ears i'm walking around the house doing anything i need to do is awesome man recommended next we'll talk about a book i had to chip a book in here i have just started it and I'm, my mind is already like what this book independent ed by edward burns this book if you're trying to make films if you're trying to make documentaries if you're trying to sell your product you're trying to market and distribute um you know the general know-how and the experience about making affordable and effective productions this is the guy you listen to 
Ed Bonds. You, you probably know him from, he's an actor, director, and producer, and oh, low budget movies that don't look like low budget movies. This guy will tell you how. Probably like $18, no excuse. If you're trying to make films, get this book. Okay, next is um, Camera Mug. Now, this is just for fun. The Canon 24 to 105 uh, F4 lens, uh, but it's the dummy one for your coffee. You know, screw, screw this up. You know, just perfect size, portable. You know, you could run with while you're editing, and it comes with this teaspoon. So, um, it's 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 obvious that you know filmmakers will love this if they don't already have it i hope you guys are loving it so far don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you love what you're hearing or what you're learning so number 10 phone head gear this will be appreciated it's a phone head uh, gear i i mount a gopro right now i mounted gopro right now but most of some of my top down shoots i put it on my head i might as well just uh, let's do it no. Instead of mounting, especially when you are mobile, you could turn it on and keep the record on while you do stuff with your hand down, top down. You don't have to mount it, especially when you don't have a place to mount above your table where you where you're doing your review or whatever you're doing on. Um, it actually it actually mounts the phone as well. You know, so if I take this one off, it's very solid, very 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 solid. You unscrew like this, and this one will fit in the same way. And you could twist, you could turn, you could turn any way you want. If you want it vertical, you could turn it, and it's very, very good. Very simple, very good, very sturdy. And I use it for most of my um, reviews. I'll put the link in the description. Number 11. It is, it is battery powered. Ooh, these ones, when you have these ones, you pushing force and trying to, you go, you're probably gonna be all all over the place. And uh, this just makes it easier. You just put in. Of course, you can switch between both mounts. Uh, pull it up and take it out and switch over to the other mount. Okay, and you can continue. Very very nice. The battery is internal though. Uh, you charge it from here. It's, it has a um, I think USB mini port that you connect it to this to this place here. If you can see it, it has a port here for charging. Easy, simple. The last but not the least for editors, especially the sit stand uh, uh, table. Uh, and and I've used it on the channel. And you guys see me use it every time. That's where I remove. Re, that's what I use for my reviews uh, downstairs, and I always try to um, bring it up and down when I'm, I'm making reviews. It is so helpful. But um, I just switched it up now um, to my editing desk. I got it there so that I can stand and you know do a lot of work, and it works. It works. You know, you drink coffee and you sit down all day that's not good it's not going to be healthy for anyone so you want us to be standing a lot while doing your editing overall these are my 12 gifts for anyone that's trying to give out gifts or show themselves some love this season um those will be perfect they've been so helpful to me i thought i should share with you guys so let me know what you think let me know which is the best for you and um as always, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.